Alright, I'm gonna back up a little bit. I think I don't wanna get too close. So we're gonna go into crouch mode here. Make sure. Okay, we got bug repellent on, so we should be good for a minute. We just gotta get close and uh, feed her some some flowers without her getting pissed off. Yes! Ha! Ha! Okay. I thought the uh, all the little ones were gonna try to eat us there for a minute. I was like, oh, we are screwed. Man, that was actually a little bit uh, a little bit easier than I thought. All right, let's see if we can't find another one. That was uh, that was pretty good. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome, welcome back to another really cool, really awesome, exciting episode. Today, we have a very interesting episode, actually. So, I put on the NPC mod, and uh, it's going to add in some PvP aspects, which is going to be really, really cool. You'll actually notice, um, apparently, one decided to start building right there. Like, that is, that is too 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 close um so we're actually gonna be going and trying to remove that one because uh, i do i do not want neighbors that close especially uh, not friendly neighbors so it adds in uh some really cool npcs that will uh will kind of do their own thing they'll build up structures they'll go out and and you know do things and they'll attack your base things like that um i was gonna just kind of go and find one and then uh, i started looking and i was like oh these guys are like literally right here so uh yeah we got some we got some pretty uh pretty pretty high level ones too and there's quite a few holy okay so we are uh i think we're act oh what is that is that a tried so i got some new dinos on too but uh some of them look very similar to other ones okay let's open this up we're gonna grab our ceratosaur i think this is the best option um should be fairly healed up after the cave run. It's been uh, it's been a minute, so we're gonna go out here, and uh, I've actually got. What is that, dude? Are you for real? Like literally, literally building right outside my base? No, 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 no. We can't. Uh, we can't have that. Trying to bowl at me? Okay, so we, oh, there's somebody shooting at me. Where are they shooting? There they are. Oh, good night. Okay, so we can probably harvest their corpses, but uh, I'm not worried about that right now. I kind of want to just get rid of these building okay let's hold on I want to make sure nobody's gonna eat us or kill us or anything okay you're you're ah, you're watching us let's see what do we got in here oh there we go we got a little storage box dude holy shit yo he had some good stuff okay so we're gonna have to destroy that by the looks of it Sorry, uh, dude, we can't have you living that close. That's too close. Much too close. Okay. Now, my plan was to uh, set up a couple of these. I did bring a couple. Holy, we have so much stuff on us now. Alright. I built a couple of tripwire alarms. I've never used any of this stuff before, so this is going to be uh, gonna be cool to use. Okay, there we go. Said I gotta put two of them side by side or, or close to each other or something. I don't know. Is it close enough or I don't know. Like how do these work? Unconnected. Okay, it says it's unconnected, so apparently it's not close enough. Okay, we'll put that there. Maybe it's because it's a bit too far away, I don't know. Like, I've never used these, so I, I, I don't have a clue. I'm just trying to do cool stuff. Maybe we're gonna have to come down here. 
Okay, we'll put that one there. And we'll pick this one up. There we go. Okay. So, got a tripwire alarm there. Hopefully that'll, uh, oh shit, there's people coming. There's people coming already. Where's our dino? There's our dino. Dude, this is gonna be, this is gonna be insane. It's gonna add a whole, whole another aspect to our game. Okay, maybe, maybe they're just running around doing their thing. I don't know. Um, however, we do have a couple of narcotic ones set up. So if they happen to get through the tripwire, they're gonna hit this one. Well, hold on. Hold. Oh, I walked into it. Apparently, uh, apparently I gotta be careful not to walk into it. I don't know. I haven't used these things. These are weird. Unwire. Pick up. Something walk into it? Why did that one go off? I don't see anything here. I don't know why that one went off. Okay, so those are a little screwy. Um, not even sure. Not even sure. However, we got a tripwire alarm set up. That should be good. And there is a lot of them over there. This is going to be crazy. Okay, so I'm just going to leave that the way it is. And we're going to go around. Hopefully they don't uh, think the same way. Man, that is a fairly large. Where'd you come from? Sorry, we uh, we can't have your hacker. That's probably who activated that, maybe. Alright, we gotta go clear this out. These guys are a wee bit too close. And uh, they're pushing out. Like, they're building way further out. Holy shit, here they come. Here they come. Oh yeah, we got quite a few of these guys. They're throwing spears and everything. The spear coming from that way. Where is it? Dude, there is a... Holy shit. Okay, there's spears coming everywhere. Like, everywhere. Getting hit with tranks and stuff. These guys are not messing around, okay? Where are you guys going? Some of them are just kind of running. I don't know if they're going somewhere else. They're trying to get in behind me. Poor dino. That spear is all through you. I'm sorry, bud. I am sorry. I don't even know where they're coming from. Some of them must have been hiding in the water. Dude, these guys got some good aim on them. Oh, we're coming. We're coming. We're gonna take you. No more. No more, Mr. Nice Guy. No, sir. We brought a Ceratosaur. Sorry. We are just gonna munch you. Not happening. Oh, I can't use weapons from this guy. Okay, there we go. Cause yeah. Oh, you hit me with a bola. What? Oh, and you're just gonna try running? No, nope. Sorry. You guys out here doing uh, your sentry jobs. You're not doing a very good job. I gotta say.
Nice. All right. Well, uh, let's. Uh, what are you doing over there? Some other people were just kind of out and about doing stuff. Yeah, there's another one over there. All right, we got to get rid of some of these uh, buildings, I think. Oh, damn. Look look at the look at the loot in there. Holy, man. These guys have some crazy, 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 crazy loot. I like that. Like, you're getting kind of realistic loot. Oh, man. That is, that is cool. Lots of armor. Damn. Lots of armor. Some sweet veggie cakes. You don't don't eat all those on me, you turd. And keep those on me, because you're probably gonna eat them. Just some fertilizer? Dude. Okay, let's see. What do we got in this one? You got a little fire. Okay, so not all of them seem to have uh, any loot. That's okay. That's okay. I don't need loot in all of them. We need... Oh, that snake is in there uh, helping go to work on them, too. Okay, let's see. There's a lot of, uh, a lot of buildings here. There's got to be some good loot. Oh, there it is. Dude. Okay, yeah, don't... Don't go anywhere. I don't. I do not need to get stuck in here. I'm gonna end up losing my life to uh, a bunch of AIs. Okay, hold on. What else? So these guys all have little boxes with their loot in it. I like that. Kind of gives you a, a little searching feature. Some of them are just kind of basic buildings. Dude, that is insane. Okay, we're gonna have to, uh, we're gonna have to end up emptying some of our stuff out and coming back and, uh, finishing this up because, damn, I was not expecting that much loot. Woo! Now, usually the, um, villages aren't quite this big. Like, we found a very large one right off the start, which was very surprising. So, poor guy can barely walk. Yeah, we're gonna have to uh, slowly walk this stuff over. Um, there's probably stuff we don't need to. Um, we can probably get rid of some of the cloth. My god, there is just like armor for days. So, so many gilly stone slingshot. Like. A good variation of different things, too. Oh, we got black pearls. Dude. Dude, okay. That is... That is neato burrito. Whoops, I didn't want to get rid of that fish meat. But whatever. Whatever. Okay, so we got some damn good stuff on that. Alright, I'm going to slowly bring uh, this guy over to the base. Like, super, super slowly, apparently. Um, is there not anything else? Alright. Um... You know, force feed him to me and uh, drop the rest of it, and we will get him over to the base and back here to uh, clear out the rest of this thing. You know, I'm kind of glad that uh, we don't live very far because, damn, it took forever to walk over there. A whole bunch of bags around, too. And a dilo that did not notice us, so we're gonna kind of sneak in here. And there it is. Dude, I love that you get so many just random things. It is so cool. It really adds to the fact of, you know, finding somebody's loot where, I don't know, they, they would just kind of have a bunch of these random things. This is, this is so neat. I like this. I really, really like this. Okay. One, two. I don't even know how many are here. I think we've looted most of them. Dude, that is insane. Okay, what do we got here? What are these? Oh, holy, 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 holy. You know what? I don't need all this stuff, but uh, there is some good stuff in here. We're going to take the narcos. Jerky, of course. Oh, that must have been the same. Okay, you know what? Those are, uh, those are some pretty good finds, I must say. Oh, hello. 
<coughs> Excuse me. Hey, we want to drop a couple of these things. Mm. Some of this stuff weighs a lot. I did not think about it when I picked it all up. Okay, uh, the metal can go down and crystals. We do have quite a bit of that at the house. What is that? Wool. Probably could use wool. What else we got that weighs a lot? We don't actually have much for obsidian. I don't want to drop it. <laughs> we can't really move. Those veggie cakes are damn heavy. Holy. Okay, um... Well... And why has everything got to weigh so much? That's bullshit. Stone. Ah, oh, organic polymer, whatever. Okay, we dropped the stone too. Yeah, we can move. Not very much, but we can move. I got an idea. Hold on. Hey, you. Come here. Oh, that's a good boy. Sweet. No, I'm gonna get you to stop because I don't want you to follow us all over the place. I just want to drop this off in your inventory because we can barely move. Damn, that's better. I mean, he can't move much either, but uh, we're going to munch these buildings down so they can stop respawning here. Because when I came back over here, because it took me a minute to actually empty it all out, um, there was more people wandering around the beach here. So we are going to get rid of these uh, spawned-in buildings that they have. I love it. They count as one just kind of general object, which is really neat. Get rid of it and everything inside of it goes. There we go. All right, so they got two more over there. Three, four, I don't know. One, two, three, four, looks like maybe four. So, I think I'm gonna have to go drop more stuff off. We are extremely overweight, hold on. Hold on, we can actually, see about this meat. I think a lot of the meat is uh, weighing us down too. There's a pile of meat. I mean, we got mutton and everything. Honestly, it's insane the amount of loot they have. Like, just the, the different types. Okay, we got some... Uh, what? Oh, is that fr prime fish meat? Yo! Okay. So we can at least move again. This is good. This is good. Okay. We are going to see if there's any other good loot in here. Um, I tried destroying a couple uh, buildings when I came back over here. And I noticed that there was a box in one of them. And it just kind of disappeared with the building. So uh, that's how I figured out that they're kind of one, one item. So when the whole thing goes down, everything goes down. Okay, so there's two. This looks like it's probably the last one. Holy shit. Like, that's just... That, it's insane. Absolutely insane. Alright. We're gonna have to drop some of this stuff because we are not gonna be able to move. Like, at all. Um, let's get rid of that. That. Holy shit. Like, there's, there's just... There, there's so much. Like, absolutely insane. We can... We can sort of move. All right, we're gonna get rid of these. That's that's the main thing. These have to go. Let's get rid of these things. And this should stop them from spawning beside us. I think that was all of them. I don't see any more buildings. And I don't see any more of them. Sweet. All right. I'm going to get this guy back over to the house very, very slowly. Uh, I'm going to have to drop stuff or just run the stuff over I have and then come back. I don't know. We got to do something. But I will bring you guys back once we uh, get these guys all emptied out. Okay. So this this is insane. Um, got him back over here. I'm just kind of emptying things out at the moment. But, uh, oh, the sap. We don't need the sap. That can stay in you for now. I'm soaking that. 
Anywho, um, gathering up the stuff that, uh, has to go in the fridge here and do, man, lately, this, this is absolutely insane. Okay, I think, I think we got it all. Everything that's, oh, we can't even move. Wow. Okay, you know what? You can keep the mushrooms for now and... Ours. I don't want to put the veggie cakes back in there because the damn thing keeps eating them. Like, of course it's eating them. Um. Yeah, we're just gonna slowly walk this way apparently and uh, put stuff away. So, there's so much stuff I can't even fit it all in here right now. Um, we gotta... We gotta do some organizing here. So what needs to come out? Um, you know what? The berries can come out for now. They really don't need to be in there. Um, uh, veggie cakes are way, way more important. They're super, super rare. Same with these lamb chops. Okay, don't have any more room for any of that stuff. Uh, we'll take the rotten meat out. Oh man, I wasn't expecting that much stuff. Like, that was, uh... There's a lot of stuff, holy... What is that? Why is that not... Stacking. I don't know why it doesn't stack sometimes. Sometimes it's weird. Anyways, um... Same with that. Why is that not stacking? Whatever. So maybe it's different quality. I don't know. I feel like we got the important stuff in there. That's the main thing. Um, yeah. I don't think any of that other stuff needs to go in there. Won't let me put anything in. Okay, so we got all kinds of good stuff now. We got sweet veggie cakes. We got some... Um, the hell is this the bug spray we've got almost everything we got honey we've got some biotoxins some cooked lamb chops oh man like that that is insane um we've got to get that uh that prime fish meat cooked up actually i don't want that going bad um anywho anywho that is uh that is the npc tribe Pretty damn cool. Gotta say, I was not expecting that. Um, the amount of loot from that is just insane. So, I got a lot of organizing to do after uh, after the episode here. I just kind of crammed everything into the dinos over here because I didn't know what to do. Uh, so, the beaver has almost everything in him right now. So, let's go get this stuff put in here. Um, feeding troughs probably the best option for now. I don't even know. Can't even fit it all in there. Wow. Wow. Okay. Guess we're gonna put it back in you, Mr. Beaver. Can we, uh, can we put it in you? Okay, you'll hold it. So, this guy here has a couple of seeds, which was the whole idea here. We need some fertilizer. We need seeds. Um... The greenhouse is another thing we are going to be getting set up here. So much fertilizer. I mean, I actually worked on some with the farm, but uh, we actually got some from him, which was really cool. Now, seeds. Seeds is one thing I'm not seeing. We're going to have to do a seed run. Um, we have a couple, but that is definitely not enough. We will take the... Uh, I think Roadrunner. All right, we're gonna come over here. The poo farm's doing pretty well. Um, we are gonna get a couple of these started though. So let's put that in there, that in there. That should be enough to get it going. There we go. So that one is gonna be what? That is Narco, and this is gonna be Stim. Okay, that is a start. We need more berries. Now, you can put stuff in this guy's inventory and uh, seed them, so maybe, 
Oh, maybe. That's what we'll do. We just got some veggies, actually. Um, if you didn't know, that's one of the bonus things the Iguanodon can do. Um, it's a known thing by a lot of people, but sometimes very forgotten. So, anything in his inventory, you can actually seed. Um, got some corn. I don't know. Wish we had more. I think it's in the beaver, but... We got corn at least, and we'll see what the beaver's got inside of it. Really, really like to get some of these, so... Alright, so you do have citronelle and rockroot. That is three of the big ones. We need sabaroot, which we will hopefully find. Alright, let's open this up. And we're just going to toss these in your inventory there, buddy. And then you hold Y, and you want to go to Seed Fruit in Inventory. Boom. Everything that's in there is now turned into seeds, which is incredible. So we have Citronella Seed, Rocker Root Seed now, and... Uh, where did you put the other one? Long Grass. There it is. I already had some. Um... We don't need all of the seeds, but uh, they are going to be handy. They're definitely going to be handy. A lot of different stuff to grow now. The fruits are the main ones. I love getting the fruits going because then you can get your um, your kibble farm going. Or really good food ingredients too. So I'm curious how these are going to work to be honest. Let's, uh, let's see. Put a rock root in there and that. I like these uh, these rustic ones. They are really cool. Citronelle and that. And we want long grass. Now I think that is everything. Shit told me which one this was. Ah, it does. Rocker root. Okay. So rocker root, citronelle. Long grass. Beautiful. Okay, so we have a good start going here. Um, we can plant other ones here, but uh, let's see. Maybe we'll do a second crop of each of these. There we go. Um, we need two more here. I still got to get rid of the rocks here, but the fertilizer was the first thing we wanted to get, and then we definitely needed seeds. Now we have both of those covered. We need some sabaru root though. So let's see if we can't find some sabaru root seeds. This guide is the seed king. Hopefully there's no uh, enemies out here. Now we have a whole new thing to keep an eye on, so. Might take us a bit to find. Oh, I think we got sabaru root seeds. I was gonna say, it might take us a bit to find what we need, but I think we actually got most of it really quickly there. Uh, Sabaru root seeds right there. What are these? Citronelle, rock root. We'll take both of those because they are still useful. Um, we might not need them right now, but we are going to take them. Take another narco. Hmm. Well, shit, I think we... Uh, I think we actually got all the seeds we need. We're just gonna drop that, get back in here, and uh, we're gonna go plant these. Oops. Come on, come on. This thing makes a pretty good uh, barricade. All right, past the fertilizer farm. We're gonna just kinda park you over here. All right, you can just stay there. Good, good, good. Okay, so. We need two more of those, which we can still build. Should have quite a... I don't know. I think we have quite a few materials still. The distance on these sometimes is really far, other times it's not. Okay, so... Let's go two more for now. Um, I'm going to put some hanging ones up and some outside ones. I love that they have hanging ones. That is just so, so neat. And then... 
They got the Mound of Earth too, which I don't know. It looks like uh, looks like it could be kind of cool. I do want to try that too. So different ones to try. However, I like these, but it's not gonna let me put it down until I get rid of this, of course. Well, I guess we're just gonna get rid of this rock. It's gonna be difficult, aren't you? Aren't ya? Well, I chose the pick. I figure we'll get a little bit more uh, flint, and it's not going to weigh quite as much. Ah, shit. We ate the narco seed. Well, that doesn't help. Well... <laughs> I mean, it don't matter. I guess we'll plant a uh, plant another one. Yeah, I like that. So this is basically the greenhouse. Um, the hanging ones here, I don't know. I'll have to build a few more, and uh, we're gonna see how they look. Might have a couple on the outside. Might have them uh, on the sides of something else. I don't know. Maybe we'll have them on the side of the uh, poo pen. Okay, you're just going to kind of hold that for us now. Um, we'll take the random shit. You can hold the rest. And we are going to crank your weight. Mostly because it doesn't need anything else. Okay, so. That is that done. Um, we already got a little bit of honey. However, I wouldn't mind taking a look for some bees. Um, flint. Flintstone metal. And metal I've been putting in here. That way we have some in our bin and some elsewhere. Alright. <clears throat> Dude. We have so much shit. So, so much. Okay. Um, we need bug spray. And... See. I have so much organizing to do. So, so much organizing to do. Oh my god. Okay, so we need rare flowers. That's what we're going to be feeding it. I think we're already re uh, wearing a ghillie suit. Let me take a look here. Yeah, we're already wearing a ghillie suit. So we just need some bug spray. Oh, man. The bees are... The bees are fun. Um... They either go good or they don't. So, uh... Let's see. Luckily, we have bug repellent, so, uh... Whoops, I don't want all of them, actually. Um, usually I don't have bug repellent, and I gotta build a couple. So, we're gonna take... Six. And I really should get some of this meat cooked up. Feels so wasteful. I don't even know... I had a medieval cooking thing until it decided to be a wiener, and now I don't. Can't cook food in that. So, gonna have to put in another cooking device. That's alright. Away she goes. You win some, you lose some. Um, you know what we need? We need a flyer. I can't believe it's so far in and we have not gotten a flyer yet. Um, I mean, we have the Pelagornis, but it's kind of sitting running our polymer farm. So, uh... Okay, we're heading to the Redwoods, which is right over there. I think there's other spots for bees. Alright, I will be back in just a sec. We're going to see if we can't find a couple of better spots for bees in the Redwoods. Okay, so there's a queen bee right here. However... Drink that, and we need you on passive. Um, I don't know where she is. I tried to take a look, and I couldn't see her. So, not sure if she's stuck in the in the wall or what. Oh shit. Come 
Come here. Hey, come here. Dude, who the hell is our damn... Oh, shit. Come here. Come here. Neutral. Eat those things. Eat them. Okay. So that did not go well. Uh, it says she's up there, but I don't, uh, I don't know where. I feel like this one is, uh, possibly glitched inside of there. We might have to go for the other one. There is another one. Where did it say the other one was? Now, there's also the beehives, too. But, uh, notice that this guy was on there, and it's like, well, maybe that'll be easier. <sighs> Alright, well, let's go see how this one is, actually. This one, uh, maybe it won't be so bad. Alright, I'm gonna back up a little bit. I think I don't want to get too close. So we're gonna go into crouch mode here. Make sure... Okay, we got bug repellent on, so we should be good for a minute. We just gotta get close and uh, feed her some, some flowers without her getting pissed off. Yes! Ha! Ha! Okay. I thought the uh, all the little ones were gonna try to eat us there for a minute. I was like, oh, we are screwed. Man, that was actually a little bit uh, a little bit easier than I thought. All right, let's see if we can't find another one. That was uh, That was pretty good. Okay, so I didn't find another uh, queen bee, but we got ambushed a couple more times on our way out of there by some more people. Um, the one actually had some riot gear, which was cool, and a couple pieces of black. They wear random shit. I don't even know. Um, so yeah, we got a bunch of random stuff in here again. However, however, the main reason we went out there is the beehive, which we did get. So... Uh, oh, dude, you're just gonna destroy everything. I'm gonna have to figure out where we want to set up the beehive. Um, this guy's just gonna destroy our base because he's cool like that. Um, I'm I'm just gonna put you back in your pen. This is why he has a pen. Um, he he just he's like a T-Rex. He just crushes everything he walks over. So you're just gonna stand there. That's a good boy. Um, you can't be destructive in there. No, sir. Close that out. So, I don't know where we are going to set up our beehive. Um, we're probably going to make a neat little spot, make it look cool. Uh, maybe we'll have a little garden around it or something. We could do a couple of the... Uh, oh, we could do a couple of the mounds. That's what we could do. A couple of these grow mounds. And uh, maybe we'll have them around here or something. This could be cool. That could be cool. Hold on. There we go, we're just going to put that there. And uh, you do have to put rare flowers in here to feed them. Just like Sue. So. And make sure you have a ghillie suit and uh, bug spray when you open it up. Um, otherwise, you will get stung. I don't think you need the bug spray, but you do need the ghillie suit. So, that is that. Um, yeah. I think we're basically going to do a little bit more work here. Put a couple more like plots in. Um, I might hand harvest some stuff here so I don't take out the tree. I really kind of like that tree and I don't want to lose it. So, uh, put a couple mounds in here. Make it look all nice and neat and pretty. Get rid of some of these, some of these bushes, possibly. Man, that was cool. So, I do like the NPC mod. That is really, really neat. Um... A bit overpowered, but I mean, to be honest, it's it's not too bad. It's like playing online with other people, and when you play a single player like I do, it uh, it gets you used to a lot of other stuff that you probably didn't use before. Um, this is actually empty because everybody's being used right now. I should probably put stuff back. Uh, let's get this stuff all back in here. There we go. All right. Well, we got a. Uh, few things done. We got a nice little uh, honey station set up. I wouldn't mind more, but one is better than none. It gives us at least a little bit. Um, I want to get a kibble farm going. So the next episode, we are probably going to get started on taming up a Uteranus. Um, 
now that we've actually went and dealt with a bunch of people, we should have enough materials here to build up some more better drinks. Uh, what do they need? I'm just going to take a look here quickly. Um, so, Tier 2 needs Biotoxin and the Bangin' Drinks. So, pretty sure we actually got quite a bit of Biotoxin there. I think there's more on the Dino as well. So, let's grab those... Alright, so it's not a lot, but uh, these are crazy, crazy potent. We're going to use them next episode, and we are going to go take us down a Uteranus. It doesn't even matter the uh, the level. It's only for a kibble farm. So uh, that is going to help us tame everything. We'll be able to make exceptional kibble and use that to tame up absolutely everything. So I think we got everything put away, and uh, everything... Oh, we should put the bug spray away. I don't think we're going to need it on us at the moment. Got to get some light going, which now we actually have some sap, so I'm probably going to get some more uh, light going after the episode. Uh, work on a little bit more of the house. Got like partially done, because there's always so much to do, and some things just kind of get pushed to the back. Um, try to organize all this loot that we've collected, because it is just insane. However, really enjoying it. Not going to lie. Really gives a purpose to some of these things that I haven't been able to use. Um... Yeah, I think that uh, I think that's gonna do her. Let's go see. Make sure nobody's spawned back in over here. Okay, we seem to be doing okay. Nice. Okay, so yeah, they didn't just respawn, which is good. Um, they are gonna spawn all over the place, kind of like a dino, and I do like that. We actually have. Oh, that's cool. I feel like these are actually building up as they sit there too, like. I feel like they got a bit of evolution to them. Um, I remember seeing that. It looked like it was just a little shack. Now it's actually looking a little bit more like a house. Um, really cool, though. Really, really cool mod. I am having fun with that. So, oh, God. Yeah, the organizing in here, too. Oh, I'm bad with organizing, guys. Like, absolutely terrible with organizing, as you can see. Uh, oh, my God. This is terrible. I need to spend a minute and just get things put away. Put them where I need to. Uh, we got windows that aren't even matched up because, yeah, whatever. Is that a Tapachara? It is 25. Of course it is. We need to get some, uh, some flyers going. We got a lot to do. A lot to do. This is going to be a very good series. Lots going on. Um, should probably get some metal cooking down. That is probably the next thing. These are still doing pretty good. Wood's getting a little low, but, uh... Seem pretty good in all the rest of the stuff. And I'm going to start moving out from the base now because we're going to get cleared out a bit in here and starting to run low in the resources. Still a few more of these like banana trees I'm going to take out. Um, possibly. I don't know. I kind of like them. But I'm, I'm back and forth on them. Like they, they're nice, but they're not. Now we do have a few things here. Like these rocks are going to go. The dead tree. Um... Yeah, no, that's good. Oh, why are you out there? Oh, did somebody try coming in? Would not surprise me. This is why I have these guys here. These guys are here to help protect in case any of those NPCs try getting in. Uh, it seems to be working pretty good. Because we don't have turrets and all that set up yet. So we, uh, we use dinos for protection. Like, I don't know. I would not want to go head to head with that. Like those those things are gonna chew you up. Like not necessarily chew you up, I guess. But like, look at that shit. I I don't know. I would not go against that. But uh, might bring these out just a little bit. Anywho, I think that's gonna do it for the episode. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to give this a big old thumbs up. And uh, if you're new here, maybe consider subscribing. We do all kinds of cool and fun stuff. And until next time, keep being kind to one another, keep being kind to yourselves, and I will see each one of you guys here real, real soon.